Okay. So, this are the minimum system requirements to play Marvel Spider-Man Remastered on your PC. And this was how the game was working on my PC before. It gave only 5 FPS and was constantly freezing. And this are my PC specs on which I am playing this game, which are very low for this game. But this was how the game was working on my PC after doing all the steps shown in this video. It gave above 30 FPS and was very smooth to play. So, before starting the video, if you have 2 or 4 GB RAM PC with no graphics card, then I am not gonna give you any fake hope. This game won't even open in your PC. So so, leave the video right now. Sorry and thanks for watching till here. So, hi this is Low End Gaming and as you have seen the results, let's see the process and get started without wasting any time. So, for the step 1 we will change the in-game settings of the game. So first open your game launcher and open settings. In display, set the window mode to full screen. Resolution to lowest, that is 800 times 600. Then turn off all other settings. Now go to graphics. Then select the very low preset. And change all the remaining settings to low and untick the quality settings. Now click on apply and open your game. But wait don't play it now. After opening the game, again go to settings. Go to display and graphics. Check once again if anything is set to high. If yes then set it to very low or turn it off. Apply the changes and play your game. So, this is how the game works after doing the step 1. The game is working on 800 by 600 on lowest in game settings. It gave around 15 to 20 FPS here I am recording. That's why the gameplay seems not that smooth. Don't worry it will run smoothly on your PC. Let's move to step 2 and get more FPS. So, for the step 2, we will use the upscaling methods, like AMD FSR and IGTI FSR, this settings help us to boost frame rates, in just one click. So, in Spider-Man Remastered, we can see 2 FSR techniques, AMD and IGTI, I'm just gonna tell you is that, try both and choose what's best for your PC. Go to settings and in upscale methods select your choice and set it to ultra performance and apply it. This is the game working on AMD FSR on Ultra Performance. It gave around 25 FPS and was very smooth to play. And this is the gameplay of IGTI on Ultra Performance. It gave around 20 to 25 FPS and was also smooth to play. So, it's your choice try both and choose what's best for your PC. Hope now your game is little bit playable. If your lag was not fixed or you want more FPS, then just keep following me. For the third step, we will use Low Spec Experience, a game optimization app for low-end PCs. Download link is in the description below, download and install it. Now open and then click on Optimization Catalog. Then in the drop-down list find and select Marvel Spider-Man PC. Then click on Load Optimization Pack. Then select the pack of your choice, I select Plain Low. Then set the resolution to 640x480. Then click on Execute Optimization. If you get any error like this, then just click on Fix Resolution. Then close this app and now open Re Switch app, then type 640x480 in the resolution box. And click on Execute Re Switch. Now open your game without closing the app and the game will now launch at 640x480. Then make sure you selected a upscale method and set it to ultra performance. Now just enjoy your game on lowest graphics with high frame rates. This is the gameplay of AMD FSR at 640x480 on lowest possible settings. It gave around 25 to 30 FPS and was very very smooth to play. And this is the gameplay of IGTI at 640x480 on lowest possible settings. It was also very smooth to play. So, we are now done with the in-game tweaks. Now we will do some external tweaks to boost FPS. Let's get started with the external tweaks. First, open your display settings and click on graphics properties. Then enable hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. Then in graphics preference, browse and add Spider-Man Remastered. Then click on options and set it to high performance. Second, open your NVIDIA control panel and go to 3D settings. And in program settings, select Spider-Man. Now just follow me and copy my settings as it is.
After changing all the settings just apply them. And we are done with all the methods and steps. So, now I hope that your game lag was fixed and you can now at least play your game. So, if this video helped you then make sure to like this video and if you are new to my channel then make sure to subscribe to my channel. See you all in the next video. Bye.